Got to get back to the issue of taxes. Congressman Tom MacArthur is with us. Now, he is a Republican from New Jersey. Sir, Congressman, welcome to the show. <laughs> well, good morning, Stuart. Thank you. Uh, may I point out that you may have a problem with this tax, uh, tax bill here because you come from a high-tax state. Uh, the plan suggests that you can no longer deduct those high taxes from your federal tax return, which means that high-income earners in New Jersey may end up paying a whole lot more in taxes and not getting any kind of cut. Will you still vote for this tax cut if it, if it, it does away with that deduction? Well, you just defined what my last uh, two months have looked like, and I've been fighting for uh, this very issue. I want to see tax cuts for uh, the vast majority of American individuals and families, and certainly I want to see tax cuts for our businesses as well. It has to be fair, though, and I've been uh, working with our leadership to make sure that we don't just wholesale eliminate the deductibility of of state and uh, local taxes, property taxes. Yeah, but and I think, you're not going to get your way. I mean, it doesn't look like you're going to get your way. So if that well, deduction goes away or even part of it goes away, will you still vote yes? Uh, you know, you, uh, uh, politics is the art of the possible, and I believe that we will, in fact, retain uh, deductibility of property taxes. That's exactly what I've been working on for months and uh, to me that's the biggest issue because one our property taxes are so high in new jersey yeah well and and hold on. you you were at the meeting <laughs> i know you're laughing but i know you were at the meeting last night with kevin brady and it was all about the state and local taxes tell us did they agree to back off so you keep the deduction what did they say to you i don't want to unveil the reform package before the chairman of ways and means does tomorrow but uh, I'm here to say I believe that we have successfully retained uh, deductibility of property taxes. And that's, that is so important. Uh, that, that, uh, that, that, okay, that's property taxes. The big deal is income taxes. Not, not in my state. Not in my, here's, here's the issue, Stuart. For, for most Americans, deductibility of, uh, certainly in my state, deductibility of property tax is the bigger issue. Income tax goes up and down with your income. So people of, of lower and moderate income, they're not going to itemize anyway. And, and people at higher income levels, that's, that's uh, less my concern. I want to make sure that middle class Americans get a tax cut. Property tax is the one that has no that's relationship true. to your income. And yep. so I have, I have in my district 140,000 seniors. These are people on a fixed income, but they've been many, in many cases in their homes for 25 and 30 years. Yep. And those homes has, have escalated in value, and their property taxes are by far the bigger issue for them. And that's what I've been fighting for, Fair is point. to keep Fair those yeah. deductible. So, so I can conclude the following. You had a meeting with Kevin Brady last night. It was about state and local taxes. You got an agreement to exclude property taxes. You still get the deduction from that. But you can't do anything about the deduction for income taxes, and that's going to clobber the rich. Can I leave it like that? <laughs> well, like I yes. said earlier, everything is a compromise. Rates, are, rates will come down dramatically. That's what I'm going to look for. The, I'm going to look to make sure that the final tax package brings down taxes for the vast majority of Americans. Vast and yeah, I'm not gonna, but I'm, not the 1%. I, the 1% well, will pay more. I'm not going to get everything I want, and you're probably right. There, there, there'll be yeah. some compromises, but if we can get real tax relief to... The, the majority of the American people, the, the middle class, the aspiring middle class, the upper middle class, that will drive economic growth. If we can let our businesses invest more instead of having sure. government bureaucrats invest it, that will grow our economy. And so sure. I, I, I didn't answer your question directly about how I'll vote because I have to wait and see what the final bill looks like. Okay. But I, 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 after 30 years in business, I know how to compromise. Okay. And, if I, and I, if I can get 80% of what I want, then I will compromise and, and make sure that we do the best deal we can for the American people. Thomas MacArthur, Republican from New Jersey, the great state thereof, where I happen to live, uh, Mr. Congressman. So, uh, ah, okay. <laughs>